It's Christmas Day, so to all of you who are celebrating, Merry Christmas. Hope you're having a wonderful day with the family. I put together this video to give you guys a good laugh. This is our funniest moments from the past several years. Black to beige bloopers. Enjoy. <laughs> okay. Uh, bolt cutters are gone. <laughs> what is Woo! Yeah, yeah, that was not good. Yeah. It's a good thing the, one, the, one, the mic don't want to prove. Dude, yeah. I'm so glad there's no sharks here right now. Yeah, I'm so glad that I probably rope didn't had a panic attack. I'm so glad that rope didn't get caught in you. Dude. I would have let it go. So we're here with Matt Harvey. While we were fighting that, well, while Kevin, while Kevin was fighting that shark, Matt, uh, Matt's got a story to tell. Matt, what happened, bro? Well, I threw my line out and didn't think I had anything on, so I put it back into the tube, the holder, and went over to check the shark out that Kevin had caught, and uh, next thing I knew, the tube was knocked over and the pole was going straight into the water. Look at the swell. The eight foot swell. Oh, God. All right, get on the anchor, please. Oh my gosh, guys, we gotta move right now. All right. <laughs> really? <laughs> really? Go up and down slow, up and down slow, okay? There we go, yes. Up and down, there we go. Over here, keep going right here, there we go. Turn one, there we go. Oh, keep it up, keep it up, who cares, who cares, who cares, who cares, come on, come on, come on, dude, come on, come on, keep it up, keep it up, keep it up, doesn't matter. He's pulling, he's pulling, he's pulling, Drake. There we go. The real one. Where's the line? The line's behind the wall. Hold on, hold on. I think it's in the wreck. Hold on, I think it's out. I think we're out, dude. I think we got him, bro. Josh, if I do all this work and this thing break off, Back up, back up. It broke off? Yes, bro. Yes. Woo! We got everything back. What else Speechless, we got? dog. We got the 130. Speechless. Mm. We got the 130 TA. Right. So you weren't moving for sure. I didn't I went like this and, and as soon as I went like that, he pulled back. I'm talking about when I first took them. You were in neutral? I was in neutral 100 percent Whatever that was, it took it. It took it. I know, bro. It crushed us. I know. That's why. That's why. I'll, if you notice, a lot of my real handles have been switched up for fifty. I mean, really? Okay, this is what happened. We get over here. No, I got this. Dude, I don't give up, bro. I'm not. I'm not done yet. Okay. Oh, I was just gonna handle. We're here today with Carter Andrews. It's the Muller. Woo! Audio clipping, Sorry, check, buddy. check, audio clipping. All right, <laughs> let's do that again there. So we're here. Man, my ear hurts. That is with big boy Carter Andrews. Next time you guys go fishing with Carter Andrews, bring earplugs and, and wear headphones the whole time, or you're gonna have constant ringing in the ears. Is this really happening right now? I, you know, I see that I just can't even believe anymore. So, we're here at the boat ramp. The truck won't start. It's amazing timing though. The boat and the truck stalls right here. So, it's actually at a point right now where the boat physically can't get in the water and the truck can't get out of the boat ramp. So we've clogged up the entire system here. The truck won't start. We ran out of fuel. Look, you can pan in and just see. How close the engine is to the water? I mean, it's so close, guys, look at that. We were so close, yet so far. We were, we were trying to catch some fish today. Um, so we're gonna have to call a tow truck, and you got to tow the boat and the truck, which I've never even seen before. But this is, you know, we're making, we're making history here on Black to Base, guys. I mean, seriously. Life lesson is, if you guys ever get a boat, always fuel your truck before you put fuel in your boat. If you, if you put the boat before the truck, and the truck runs out of fuel like today, you're, in a, you're, you're gonna end up in this situation. You may not even get to the boat ramp. We at least got here, so there was a little bit of hope. We might have gone fishing. Oh, All right, I'm in park. Hold on. Oh yeah, I can get it off. Oh man. 
Nice. Four strokes. Here we go. Here we go, people. We might go fishing today. Oh my gosh, people. It is looking good. It's looking very good. Yeah. The battle is halfway over. We got the boat in the water. I came close. Hey, just throw it in the back of the gray Ram 3500 when you're done. All right, thank you. I appreciate it. Is this it's the one with the stickers on the back? Now what? Now what? Hold on, Tyler. Huh? Hold on. You gotta run it through here first. All right. Come on. This could end up in a disaster. We could we, we be banned tires, but I can't truck them off right now. Oh, please, let's not talk about that. All right. Tight. Dock right now with Cody and Tyler from Do Perfect, and the goal today is to find some sailfish. They've never seen one or caught one. That's not true. That's not true. Cody's got one. And he's seen you them. Caught one? Yeah. He, said, he saw them. Okay, okay. 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 Um, I stand corrected, guys. We have seen some sailfish. So who hasn't caught one? I've never caught a sailfish. Okay. I've seen them though. You caught a marlin though. I've caught a white marlin, not a blue. Not a blue. Okay. Well, the blue would be exceptionally unreal <laughs> okay. in Florida. Okay. Okay. I like the honesty. If, yes. So it's not guaranteed that it's we're going to catch a blue. It's not a guarantee blue. that we're going to catch a blue marlin. I promise. Okay. I, I can guarantee you that it's not a guarantee. Uh, good. Are you good. like that? You like that? That is a good guarantee. That is a good guarantee. Yes. Yes. Yeah, so that's the new phrase, guys. These guys really uh, bust my chops with the whole guarantee. <laughs> we did a lot of chop busting. A lot of chop busting. I can't say guaranteed anymore, even no. though. When I know it's guaranteed, I can't say it anymore. Can't say it. I was gonna say we might catch a fish. There you yes. go. It, it makes them much happier, actually. Yeah, hundred percent. One of the first comments on your trip, Josh, was, "Oh, that'll go viral. It has to." <laughs> and, and there's no it other choice. To. Yeah. It, it, did it, 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 it doesn't have an option. You told me to make millions. <laughs> <laughs> what, what you guys are looking at right now is a back of the boat intervention. We're trying to help Josh with his his extreme statements, like "I guarantee," or, or "They'll bite in one second," or "A hundred percent." And it's fine to be confident. It all stems from his excitement. It all stems from his excitement. No one knows thing. how excited. You know what? I'm gonna have your audience hold you accountable to this intervention. Yep. You think that's fair? I think that's totally yeah. fair. If you guys see him throwing out a bunch of guarantees and extreme statements, just comment, Josh. Easy. Easy. I guarantee you <laughs> that someone will comment about that. Oh, I, I, I guarantee 100% that. 100% guarantee I they will. That. Yeah. I, you might catch a fish. There you go. <laughs> you might they, catch dude, a fish. That could be fun. <laughs> that you know? could be fun, right? It could be fun if we might catch some fish. Okay. Carl's gonna catch a Goliath too, guys. He's never done it. Nope. He's, he's talked a big game. We're gonna see what he can actually do today. You ready? Yep. Go, bro. He's gonna put those football players to shame. Wow. No. Oh, it's time to do this. Coming out. Oh my god. Bro, you're gonna bring my rod, dude. Am I? Yeah, come on, stand up. Stand up. I got you. <laughs> what, what are you, that Sweeney Tower of Pisa? <laughs> Watch out, dude. What What was that? <laughs> I'm showing you what it is. You fell over in slow motion. So this is the, uh, this is the secret spot? Uh, one of many.
You think I know what I'm doing? Ah, getting stabbed by a hook, snagged by trees, I'm gonna fall down a cliff. I'm gonna catch him, dude. You, you're, you've had two chances here. You film now. Had my chance. You, you All filmed. you've done is talk. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna catch him first try. Okay, you had your. You had your chance, dude. It's easy to do it the way it's supposed to be done. Oh my god. Okay, can we land the shark and then? No, no. And then we can do. catch another cobia. <laughs> dude, okay. That's not how cobia fishing works, dude. Like cobia fishing takes priority over everything. It does take priority. Oh, it does. It really does. You see a cobia, everything else stops. Yeah. Why? Because Because you don't get a chance like that all the time. Yeah, dude. These are like, it's an elusive fish. Here, look. I'm going to get this cobia right now. I'm going to show you how it's done, dude. Look, look. I got him. I got him. He's, he, he's coming up to eat it. He got it. He got it. He got it. on. Yeah, baby! Look out, look out. Woo! <laughs> he's off, he's oh. off! Oh. Let him eat it. Dude, I didn't let him eat it, bro. What the <laughs> f oh my f oh, No, you didn't. <laughs> Why is the drag so loose? <laughs> 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 I'm glad we got that. We got that, guys. That explains everything out here. That's that's the exact feeling we feel every time. Wow, this is unbelievable. What? I'm on the flats fishing with Josh. You know, and uh, I'm telling you, folks, this is unbelievable. You know, he just put me right on this fish. You know, we took 10 minutes to get out there, and, and I always call my fish when I want to catch a mackerel. If I fish for mackerel, I'm going to catch a mackerel. But you know, hanging with Josh, I learned a lot. And, and that's what happens, you know? I just threw my line on, Josh said mackerel is there, and uh, we caught a mackerel, you see how that is? You know, but you know, I got the best, I have the best captain, the best captain. <laughs> Jeez, guys. <laughs> oh, oh, man. Um, that is the story of my captain. Anytime he holds the, holds the fish, it gets off. <laughs> Tell me, what did you think when that hellfish crab? <laughs> <laughs> hey, stop. Be professional, Jay, yeah, Josh. I know. <laughs> yeah, Josh, yeah, these, these bohemian houndfish mm -hmm. always remind me. <laughs> Josh. And that's, how, and that's how you do it? Yeah, I'm here. I'm here today with, yeah. with, with Tommy. Yeah. And we're going. <laughs> and you know, we're gonna talk about uh, the 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 beautiful houndfish today. Um, Josh, what do you think about those uh, beautiful? I think they're the greatest fish in the world, greater than any permanent bonefish. Okay. What do you think? I I think so. I <laughs> think so. You know, I mean, how how did it really feel hooking up on that? 10 pound uh, hound needle fish the other day. <laughs> it actually fought really well. It fought, fought well, okay, all right. You know, it, 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 I mean, these, these, these fish are so, so incredible because they have such long, long beaks and, and sharp teeth, you know, it's, I mean, they jump, they, I mean, it's, it's, I mean, it's just something that you have to come and experience. What'd you say, Josh? I agree 100%. <laughs> <laughs> It's <laughs> mutton poison. It's <laughs> you like that? Right? <laughs> Epic. <laughs> <laughs>